real estate transactions need to be handled in a much more formal manner than a lot of other consumer transactions that can be done on a handshake. This is Dave at TitleSearch.com. A real estate transaction or transfer in almost every state is covered by a theory called the statute of frauds. And there's several provisions of the statute or the state laws covering real estate transactions. The two that are most uh, important to a potential buyer or seller that the transaction has to be in writing. I mean, it can't be a verbal or handshake or some other type of non-documented transaction. Usually that uh, results in a, a contract, a deed, a mortgage, things that can be recorded or have a wet signature. In addition to that, they have to have a, an exchange of consideration, meaning that for that piece of real estate being transferred, there has to be what's called good and valuable consideration transferred back. And you can get good legal advice from an attorney on what that might be. But in some cases, it's the dollar amount of the transfer. Some deeds will list uh, good and valuable consideration. It can even be for things like friendship or affection, and sometimes a nominal dollar amount is listed like $10. It doesn't change the fact that there was a purchase price of the property. It's just that on that deed, that was the actual consideration for that transfer. The statute of fraud is an important factor in creating a real estate transfer. It's what's behind all of the documents that are searched in a real estate title search process. If you have questions about real estate documents or searching title, you can reach us at our website at titlesearch.com.